Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a podcast using Anchor.fm and have that podcast distributed to a number of podcast networks. So let's go ahead and get started and we'll sign up for an account. Now you can sign up using Facebook or Twitter or you can sign up using an email address instead. Let's say I want to make a new podcast and let's call this one The Mason Barks Podcast. Now you can always change the name. And I chose this name because, well, we're going to use my dog's email address to set up this account. Now we can upload an image if we want to put an image here in our cover. Let's go in and find a picture of Mason and we'll find him right in here. There he is. And we'll say this podcast will feature Mason's thoughts about life. Now our category here, let's just go in and call this one performing arts. So we now have our address for this podcast. If you want to take out the space, uh, the dashes, you can do that. And now we'll set this up. And now we've signed him up for an account. So this is the anchor.fm web dashboard. You can also record by using the Android app or iOS app that Anchor offers. And as you can see, you can upload files that you've recorded with a different audio program. Or if you're trying to create a podcast made by your students in your classroom and you want all of them to record and then upload to one account that you manage, this would be the way to do that. Have students record using another audio recorder and then upload directly the files. In this case, we can record, we'll record a new segment. We'll use the microphone. And now we're recording. And we can talk about whatever we would like to talk about for as long as we need to. And we'll just say that Anchor.fm is a great way to easily produce a podcast. So we'll see this is now saving. And we can edit the name of the episode. We'll just call it episode one. the introduction. Now there's our podcast episode. Click the plus symbol, move it over here and click save. And our episode name is episode one, the introduction. We'll use that description. Now when we go to publish this, we can schedule it to appear at a later time. We can publish immediately. We can save it as a draft. In our advanced publishing settings, we can say we want to publish it to everywhere, or we can publish it to just Anchor. Now, if we select Publish to Everywhere, it'll be submitted to iTunes, to Google Play, to Spotify, and three other podcasting platforms, which I'll list in the description of this video. If you decide to do that, however, bear in mind that there are some standards of quality that those platforms may enforce. So if you do a test podcast like I've just done here, it probably will not be accepted by those other services. Now we're ready to go ahead and publish the episode. 
and it's available to listen to now on Anchor.fm on our channel. We can listen to it right there. We can give people the link to it and they can listen to it. You'll see we can also embed that. And if we want to look at our home screen, there's our home screen and there's our podcast profile. And our podcast profile is where everything that we produce from here on out will appear and people can follow our profile and listen to every single episode. Now again, when we produce that podcast, we can sub submit it to all of those other podcasting networks that I mentioned. So that's how you can create a simple podcast using anchor.fm. We've only scratched the surface of all the features that it offers, but that should get you started. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out practicaledtech.com and freetechforteachers.com.